Good morning. So today is Thursday and it's gonna be a slow day today. Um, I just got up and I was talking to my friend for a bit on the phone and now I'm having my second coffee and watching some YouTube. Um, it's very chilly this morning. I think it said it was only 14 degrees, but the house is cold. Um, so I have my robe on and it feels like a fall morning, which I have mixed feelings about. I like, I like fall, but I love the summer heat, so. Um, yeah, we'll see. I hope it gets warmer. I'm not ready for fall yet. Anyways, um, I'm gonna make breakfast soon. I'm gonna try to make this, like, really good breakfast sandwich. I'm gonna make a breakfast sandwich, and then I have a, a video call at, um, 9.50, and then we have to cut the grass this afternoon. Probably gonna go on a bike ride, and we'll see what else we get up to today, but I will bring you along. Okay, I look like a bank robber, but... Um, Ruger and I are just gonna go for a bike ride. I can only take him for about 10 to 15 minutes because he's running beside me so he gets really tired. Um, and so then I'm just gonna take him quickly. I just have on this all black outfit. It's cool this morning so that's why I thought I would go ahead and take him right now and get him some exercise and then I should probably clean up all this mess but you know how it is. Um, and I also need to make myself some breakfast still so let's go on a bike ride. Okay, we just got back from our bike ride. Ruggies is a tired man. We did two kilometers, 20 minutes, so it doesn't seem like that long, but for him, I'm sure it is very long because he's running, but he likes it. Um, and now we're just gonna make some breakfast and chill. So on my wedding day, I asked my mom to buy these breakfast sausages because I was obsessed with the breakfast sandwich from McDonald's, which I still am. So I'm just gonna put one of these patties on a frying pan and we're gonna make an egg patty sandwich okay so here's my breakfast i have these um odo's gluten-free bagels and i have a sausage patty an egg and half an avocado and uh, hopefully this tastes really good so derek's work actually gave him a quarter of a cow which is awesome for our budget so this is all sorry this is all beef um and just stuff i've never like a whole bunch of different kinds of steak like rib steak and t-bone steaks so i've never really like dealt with different kinds of steaks so i'm just gonna pick one and then we're going to just play with it i guess um let's try the blade steak and then i'm gonna google recipes on it i'll bring up the rib steak as well just in case okay so I have a blade steak and a rib steak in here and I put a little bit of beef broth and water because I didn't have enough beef broth left then I put onion powder salt pepper garlic and lemon juice on top of the steak and it's now 11 and I have it on low and we will see how this goes I literally just made this up so nothing I make usually turns out horrible but Never done this before, never made steak in a slow cooker, so we will see. Okay, I have a little grocery haul for you. Um, they, I bought some carrots to make carrot fries with. Those are a staple. I got some veggie lovers, um, lettuce just to make salads with. I got two, pen, two sets of pens because we are forever looking for pens in this house, so I just went and bought some. I hope they're good, I'm very picky with my pens. Um, I got the Monterey Jack cheese slices for breakfast sandwiches um, and burgers and whatnot. Um, I got some little tomatoes. I love these little tomatoes. I got some shaved turkey breast. I haven't had that in a while either. I got these Bluetooth headphones. They were only $20. These are from Giant Tiger. Everything else is from Walmart. Um, so I'm excited to use these and not have to use a cord. I got these, are another staple, smoothie bars, peanut butter fudge, they're only 100 calories and really, really good. Um, I got blueberry bagels for Derek, one avocado, I got a bag of shrimp, I've never bought shrimp before, but I think I like it, so I'm going to try to cook with it and see what happens. Then behind that, I have uh, broccoli florets that I'm going to use for my lunch today, and I'll show you what that is. Um, I got some head and shoulders smooth and silky because I need a new shampoo. Two packs of gum for Derek's cars. 
Um, I got some strawberries. I was gonna make a chicken salad um, today, but I forgot to get chicken, so I'll just eat the strawberries. Um, I got this thing of potatoes because I thought it was so cute. It reminds me of like, I don't know, like farm, farm fresh or like the ones that you go pick yourself. I don't even know if that's a thing, but anyways. This looked cute. I got them. I got my Odo's everything but the bagel. Or everything and the bagel, I guess. Um, everything bagels. And, oh, I forgot. Oh, my gosh. I brought a list, and I didn't even look at my list. Very interesting. Okay. Anyways, um, I just got bagels. I just remembered I had a list. And, okay. Anyways. So, anyways, bagels. Yep, these are good. Love them. And now I'm going to put this all away and make some lunch. Okay, so in here for lunch, we have some broccoli boiling. So you bring it to a boil, um, add some water, and then bring it to a boil, obviously. And then once it's boiling, you take it off and you leave it for like three minutes around. And then another first today is we're making shrimp. So I've never, I just recently learned I like shrimp. So I've never actually made it. So I just have some butter here. Um, and the one that I'm using, I just showed my grocery, grocery haul, this Pacific white shrimp cooked. So I just pulled all their tails off and I'm gonna cook it up in here with some butter and hopefully that's right. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic and some lemon juice. So full of first today, but that is what's going on for lunch. Okay, so I just uh, put the drain to the broccoli and put it in here with some onion powder. Then I put my shrimp and butter and garlic mixture all over top of it. So let's see how this tastes. Added a bit of lemon juice and sure it'll be okay okay so my mom just left um we went for a, i went for a bike ride and she walked to the dog she brought her dog so that was fun and we just had a, some wine and chatted um and now i have a bacardi breezer this is left over from my wedding and i'm putting it in my yeti and i'm gonna go cut the grass because i need to finish that up and i love having a drink on the lawnmower like it's one of my favorite summer activities. So I'm gonna do that. Um, Ruger just threw up five times in the garage. So I'm gonna let him rest in here. I think it was because it was hot, he drank a lot, and then um, him and Lucy, my parents' dog, was chasing a um, chipmunk, and I think it was just too much. So I'm just gonna let him rest in here, and hopefully he doesn't throw up anymore, but definitely needs a little bit of rest, I think. Um, and so yeah, I'm gonna have my drink, I'm gonna cut the grass, and I will see you in a bit. Also, this new song, I found this girl on TikTok, Just About Over You by Priscilla Block, is so good. The lyrics are so good, and it's about like trying to get over somebody, and then they come into the bar when she's there. Um, happily married over here, but still love a good like missing you song. So that's what I'm listening to right now, and I ended up buying these Bluetooth earphones. Um, but only one of them works, so I'm going to have to return them. Um, I also bought this plaid shirt because I wanted like an oversized plaid shirt and it's like way too oversized, so I'm going to have to return that and maybe get a small, but the patterns they had in the small at the store weren't that great, so I'll keep you updated on if I get any one or not. Okay, we got our steak smelling really good and I just took a piece and it like fall, it's fall, ugh. it fell off the bone so it is really, really good and now we are having some of these potatoes that I showed in the haul and I'm just going to drizzle them with olive oil and then just put some onion, Ooh, some onion powder. Um, salt and pepper and I would normally put garlic salt or powder but we don't have any and then my secret to all potatoes I put chili powder on them and my aunt and uncle are coming over around 7 so in like an hour and it's a little bit cooler outside right now okay well the thing says 27 but I find it cold um, so I put some jeans on and it has been a minute since I've worn jeans so it feels weird it kind of feels good like how they like hold everything in um, but definitely feels like weird kind of uncomfortable but yeah jean season is back I guess I don't know anyways I'm going to make my potatoes and 
Reese is getting a drink. He seems fine after he threw up five times, but um, I think it was just the heat and like he drank a lot and then he like ran a lot, so it made him sick. But other than that, we're good in here and just getting dinner made. Just listening to Taylor Swift's new songs. I have like three that I listen to on repeat because they're so good. But I wanted to show you um, our thank you cards. So I'm starting to write them. My hand gets crampy after a while, so I have to quit because it, I get really, really messy once they start getting crampy. So I have to do like a few at a time. But this is them. I got them off Vistaprint. And it says, thank you, the Merkleys, and then this beautiful picture that my photographer picked, or took, and this is it, and then Derek's going to write his name, um, Tara watches my videos, so pretend you didn't see that. But yeah, they're really, really nice, and I love them so much, and I like the pink, um, and they came in three days, I think, so if you're... Wanting to get um, your thank you cards off Mr. Print, do that. Every time I've gotten from them, they've shipped so fast. Um, I also got our invitations from there. These were not used invitations. They ended up, um, that wedding didn't happen, but we sent them out to everybody. So, and then I, we were supposed to do a stag and so I ordered a whole bunch of stag tickets off there too. I have so many left down here, but these were the stag tickets and they were really cute too, but that didn't happen. So anyways, I've had nothing but good things to say about Vistaprint. They always have a discount code for you, so look for that and yeah, I don't know. They're super easy. You can design it yourself and um, or you can they have designs for you which I like because like I know what I want But like I don't want to do it all myself either like I like when people or when like the suggestions are already there So it's best of both worlds and yeah, nothing but good things to say about them. So thank you Vista print Okay, so here's dinner those potatoes the steak, which is so good steak in the instant pot highly recommend um, a pre-mixed mixed veggie salad and some Asian sesame dressing. So, this is going down and of course a glass of white wine.